Hi guys, Xtrapper here. Um, this is sort of going to be an update video, uh, slash toss an idea at you guys that I've been tossing around in my own head. I've had a few suggestions slash recommendations from some of my subscribers saying that I should do a Minecraft talkthrough, so I figured maybe that's a good idea. Why the hell not, right? A few things I want to go over beforehand, a few questions I want to ask, and again, this isn't a guarantee, so don't get too excited, and please don't get upset at me if I decide not to do this. First and foremost, I don't know too much about this game. I know the bare necessities, I know how to play the game, I know how to do most everything. I don't know anything about the nether, I don't know anything about the end, I don't know anything about potions or enchanting or anything like that. Um, I kind of know about the breeding of animals, I don't know, I get the idea. But as far as that's concerned, I'm going to need your guys' help when I'm playing through this so that I know what the heck I'm doing and you're gonna have to bear with me if I'm doing things wrong or you know just don't get upset with me if I'm doing stupid things the second thing I wanted to go over is that this is not going to be an everyday update sort of thing I don't even think I'm gonna refer to this as a let's play I'm leaning more towards doing either a, a weekend upload schedule or a whenever I feel like it upload schedule Probably more the weekend thing because I like having things set in stone. I don't like just tossing things and just, alright, it's Tuesday. I feel like uploading and then not uploading again for three weeks. You know, I don't like that sort of thing. So I think the sticking to a schedule is probably more st my style. Um, a few questions for you guys as far as the game itself is concerned. We have the game here, obviously. We have the default texture pack. I have two other texture packs downloaded right now. Uh, this one right here is a photorealistic x256 mod and I'm gonna I'll show it here and I, I'm trying to let you guys decide what I should go with if I do decide to do this because I'm not sure you know it's your guys thing so it's for your enjoyment might as well have you do it so let's see what this this texture pack looks like it's pretty neat I like it um, it might be a bit much so that's why I'm showing it so we got I'm and I spawn in a tree. This is the texture pack. It's a photorealistic texture pack, so everything looks kind of real. Great, we spawned right by. Is this a ravine? Looks like it. We got some pigs. You know the blocks look pretty high detailed here. I don't know if this is too much for you guys or too much at all. You know, just in general, things are very detailed in this. Uh, the weapons and armor and stuff like that looks different. So that's this texture pack. Let me save and quit here. And this is the Oka Okami texture pack. I'm not entirely a fan of it, but if you guys really like it a lot, I I'm willing to give it a shot. Um, my thing with this is it's very, very bright. <laughs> As you can see, you know, it takes all the texture straight from the game Okami, which is a good game. Don't get me wrong. Um, but things. It's very bright. I mean, I have nothing wrong with it. You got the moon there, which is pretty neat. It's just a, uh, it's like cell shading. Cell shaded. I mean, I guess I shouldn't say that I don't really like it. It's not bad. I prefer the either, I prefer the photorealistic one. I guess that's the deal, you know. So that's that one. And you know, in case anybody hasn't seen the default look of Minecraft, I'll show that off too. So at least you can compare it. This is the default. Very less detailed. But you know, it's just, it's the default. You know, this is what everybody had to begin with and most people are used to. So I have no problem working with this too, if that's what you guys would prefer. And if you guys have any suggestions of other texture packs that I should give a shot or you think are better than the ones I have, I have no problem with that. Just let me know. Um, one last thing, as far as the future of this goes, if I do decide to do it, now I'm not guaranteeing that and I want to get that clear in this video if you haven't told, if you couldn't tell. Um, if I decide to play, in the future, I'm willing to give a shot with add-ons. I know there's a lot of them. I've never really dabbled in them at all. So that'll be completely blind to pretty much anything you tell me to give a shot at. Um, and that's in the future. And another thing, I'd, be, I'd rather not be overwhelmed with the add-ons. If you guys do, feel free to suggest, suggest them. But I can't do everything all at once so I'm gonna have to pick and choose because I'm pretty sure only certain add-ons are compatible with certain things and I may need your help getting all that stuff set up I don't know yet we'll see how this that goes though when the time comes I think that's pretty much it as far as this is concerned um, 
another thing, you know, I, I've had recently, I've had a big influx of subscribers. I don't know where they came from, and I'm not going to complain, and I'm, I'm not one to beg or ask for subscribers, but it feels really good getting comments and everything on my videos, and I love interacting with my subscriber base, so continue to comment, please, if you'd like. Subscribing, I really could care less, but comments are always great. I love to hear feedback, whether it's positive, negative, or or whatever it helps me grow as at what I'm doing here I've only been doing this for about a month now but I'm really enjoying it it's definitely something I want to keep doing um, so yeah I hope there's nothing I forgot if there is I'll try to put it in the description below but I think I got everything covered that I wanted to cover so just let me know what you guys think and give me your ideas uh, thank you for watching this and maybe I'll see you in this land in the in the near future